three of them are like over Those are there. awesome. They are so yeah, these boxes awesome. are awesome. Seriously. They are. Those, those look good. Who sees this video? Go and buy these. For the cards, because you're, you're probably going to enjoy them. But more importantly, for the decks. Yeah, I think, yeah, some of my cards went to your deck. Yeah. The game as a whole is just fun. Yeah. And like, these deck box, one of these deck boxes holds, and I'll show you what one of those deck boxes holds. You got another one on you? Yeah, because you get two yeah, starter decks. you get decks. two in the starter pack. Holds several dice, a start, a, a set of dice, a whole three decks. This is a 53 card deck and it fits in here perfectly. <laughs> Your side deck and your extra deck. Oh, by the way, plus um, some extra cards if you want. Did I give you anything else for your extra deck that you need to get back? Uh, yeah, cards. You gave me back the ancient fairy dragon. I know I have to give you something else back. How did that Gigantis work for you, by the way? Gigantis? Yeah. I never got her effect off, but you know what? The fact that I can summon a knight, especially summon a knight in hundred meters, it's pretty nice sometimes. Okay. I was just curious how that one up. Oh, the rock spirit. How was that? Oh, the rock spirit? Yeah, same kind of thing. It was funny because some guy actually used a, uh, flipped it face down because he, because he couldn't attack over it. Because it's 2,000 air points right now. Yeah, so he, so he had to negate the effect and it's like, oh like, my god, that's all fake. No, really that rock spirit. <laughs> so we're doing Kajudo here. So these are our shields. You have to play, you play five of them. Yep. When all five are gone, and then you would attack. I, from what I remember, is once they're all gone, and you get a direct hit, and you lose, right? Yep. Yeah. Draw. I like it. Go. Draw. So much faster. No, not the one drop guy. The one drop guy, go. Go. Yeah, my deck's more of a slower controlly one versus this. Draw. Three mana. Tap both. For Ambush Scorpion. There's your famous first two turns. Tap for to hit that shield. Shield blast. Okay, it's your turn. Oh, these are, this is your mana. And you can tap any card for one mana of that color. Whenever you play a card, you have to tap that mana, at least one mana of that So in order to bring this onto the field, you would have had to tap one red? One red card, yeah. And this, I have to tap one green plus one other card. Your turn. I love this guy. Whenever, whenever he attacks, you draw a card. I'll put a sprout in there. Tap two more to play a sprout. Yep. Well, it's rapid throw. But it's a random rapid throw. Return to soil. Yeah. Worth it. Okay. Um. Wait for me to get a good creature. Make it into a. I'll tap for two. Into mana. Do I need to know what exactly all hyper aggro No kidding, wow. If I get the perfect hand, it's hyper aggro. Basically, if he doesn't play Defender this turn, he loses. Yep. You play Defender this turn? That Defender, too. Err. That Defender times two. <laughs> <laughs> I'll break this shield and draw for this effect. Okay. I'll break shield with your mouth. Go ahead. Oh, I'll break mine. Okay. Yep. Some of the effects have a shield blast where you can hit them for no mana if you destroy the shield. Like Sprout. Yep. So Sprout's actually quite cool. Ten blockers, yo. Ten blockers. Okay. One mana. Tap four. Four. Drag light the swiftest. <laughs> There's haste to this game too. <laughs> yeah, fast attack. And then tap one for another blaze bonus. <laughs> you only had one blaze bonus here. Apparently I have two. And apparently I have two sprout too. Nice. Swing for three. Oh. 
block two, and they have four thousand power, so these die. But have an effect since there are four thousand blockers and only cost two mana. If they win a battle, they die. And when we cast shield dies. Uh, shield blast. Oh god. Bone blades. I can just kill the creature. On tap. Nope. Level four under. Oh, that's gay. Oh, it's your he lives. And now he's gonna start to win. Just look at his hand. It's pretty easy. Is there a maximum hand having I don't know. We have to look that up. I would imagine. Oh, what's your starting hand? Five. I imagine your maximum hand size is six then. But we don't know for sure, so we can't say. Yeah. It could be like Pokemon and Vanguard where there is no hand limit. Good. And it'll make sense because they're practice. Fucking lockers, man. Them cards in your hand. That had advantage. Oh. Class attack takes four for two, and this is three for two with that. So they're saying class attack is better than that. It is, because you gotta get. Because only cards with block can block. Yeah, but not great, no regular cards can block. Ooh. Oh. oh. <clears throat> that's that's, that's oh, why I think my class attacker is so good. Tap two for an Amber Scorpion. Tap four to rock bite, destroy banish a creature with three thousand power or less. Using him? Yeah, so we get your last shield. Yeah. Go. <laughs> yep. You get two blockers that lose. Look at my hand. Oh wait. Mind games. Mind games don't, nothing mind games don't work in this. There's nothing. You can't play cards on my turn. Tap four to spy mission. Spy mission's awesome. It's a shield blast. It lets you draw two cards. Yeah. Uh, shield blast basically means that if a shield is destroyed in that shield blast, you just you can instantly play it. Tap two, four. Three, five. I win. <clears throat> yeah, if I had one more mana, I could have definitely done something. Because I would have been able to block him on your next turn and been able to death smoke him. But yeah, I did let's, let's just say you attack shield. If you were to do that, I would get worthless and then draw him to a harvest. Yep. So he's playing round three. Round two? 